Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a car logo or name reveal effect using only After Effects and no Photoshop needed. I know many of you don't have access to Photoshop, so this method keeps everything simple and done in one place. Before we animate the logo, we first need to remove the existing name from the car, in my case it's a forklift with the Toyota logo. To do that, we'll start by masking the logo area. For a cleaner and more accurate result, I'll use Mocha AE for both precise masking and smooth tracking. Inside Mocha AE, select the pen tool and mask out the name area. Once the mask is complete, enable perspective to allow for more accurate tracking, then click the track forward button and let it finish. When the tracking is done, click save, then close Mocha AE to return to After Effects. Now under the Mocha AE effect, Expand the matte section and click Create AE Masks. Then press M on your keyboard to reveal the mask and change the mask mode to subtract. Now we can remove the black spot using Content Aware Fill. Click on the Content Aware Fill panel and match your settings to mine. Once your settings are in place, simply click Generate Fill Layer and After Effects will take care of the rest. Once the analysis and rendering are complete, scroll through the video to make sure everything looks clean and the removal worked properly. In my case everything looks great, so now we can move on to creating the name animation. Duplicate your original clip and place it above the fill layer in the timeline. Then press M to reveal the mask and delete it. Also remove the Mocha AE effect from this duplicated layer, as we no longer need it for this step. To keep things organized, I'll rename this layer to animation. To animate the name, I'll use the linear wipe effect. There are several ways to animate a logo, but linear wipe is the quickest and easiest method. If you want me to cover other animation techniques in future tutorials, let me know in the comments below. First I'll change the angle to minus 90 degrees because I want the reveal to happen from left to right. Next increase the transition completion until the name is fully hidden, then click the stopwatch icon next to it to add a keyframe. After that scroll forward to where you want the reveal animation to end, and gradually decrease the transition completion until the name is fully visible. Let's quickly preview the reveal animation. Everything looks great. The final step is to add a slight feather to soften the edges and smooth out the transition and then we are done. Hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.